This is when premium is brought in by the new or incoming partner and is withdrawn by old partners fully or partially. A and B are partners in a business sharing profits and losses in the ratio of one third and two third. And the last line is calculate proportion in which partners share profit and loss in future. This is working notes. Old ratio of A is to B is equal to 1 by 3 is to 2 by 3. That is 1 is to 2 because the denominators are equal. C is admitted for one fourth share. Let the total profit of the firm be 1. The remaining share of A and B after C's admission is equal to 1 minus 1 fourth is equal to LCM 4. 4 minus 1 is equal to 3 by 4. S new share is equal to 3 upon 4 multiplied by 1 upon 3 that is 3 upon 12. B new share 3 upon 4 multiplied by 2 upon 3 that is equal to 6 upon 12. Then C's new share that is 1 upon 4 multiplied by 3 upon 3 that is 3 upon 12. Because he is getting admission for 1 fourth share hence it is 3 upon 12. Therefore the new ratio of A is to B is to C is equal to 3 is to 6 is to 3 is equal to 1 is to 2 is to 1. Sacrificing ratio is equal to old ratio minus new ratio. A sacrifice that is 1 upon 3 is the old share minus new share is 1 upon 4. That is LCM 12, 4 minus 3 is equal to 1 upon 12. Likewise, B sacrifice 2 upon 3 minus 2 upon 4. Old share minus new share, LCM 12 in the numerator 8 minus 6 will be 2 upon 12. Therefore, the sacrificing ratio of A is to B is equal to 1 is, 1 is to 2. Then fair notes, journal entries, date particulars, ledger folio, debit credit and rupee symbols will be there. Here, first entry will be cash account debited to C's capital account to premium for a goodwill account. That is cash account debited, the amount of a capital contribution as well as premium for goodwill. That is 8 plus 6 is equal to 14,000. To C's capital account in the credit rupees 8,000. To premium for goodwill account rupees 6,000. Being capital and premium for goodwill received in cash from the new partner C. The second entry will be premium will be debited and Capital account of the sacrificing partners will be credited like premium for goodwill account debited 6000 to A's capital account 2000 to B's capital account rupees 4000. Being premium money received from new partner transferred to old partner's capital account in sacrificing ratio. The third entry is withdrawal of premium for goodwill to the extent of 100% that is A's capital account debited. B's capital account debited 2000 rupees and 4000 rupees to cash account rupees 6000. Being premium money withdrawn by old partner in sacrificing ratio, the total of debit and credit columns will be 26000 each. In this question, we are required to prepare capital account also. This is question 31. We have been given to draft the journal entries and show the capital accounts of all partners and the opening balance of capital of A and B given in the question second line rupees 8000 and 10000. Hence, draw a proper capital account for A, B and C and buy balance brought down. Capital being credit balance will be shown in the credit side of a capital account. Then post the journal first one. Cash account debited to C's capital account 8000 in C's capital account by cash account rupees 8000. Then second entry premium for goodwill account debited to A's capital account to B's capital account in capital account by premium for goodwill account for A rupees 2000 for B rupees 4000. 
then withdrawal of capital to the extent of a hundred percent by A and B. That is, in the debit side, S capital account debited, B capital account debited, two cash account in the column of A and B rupees two thousand and four thousand each. Now total the credit side of all capital accounts because these are the higher balances, and write down in the debit side. And the difference will be two balance carried down. For A, it will be eight ten thousand minus two thousand is equal to rupees eight thousand. For B, rupees fourteen thousand minus four thousand is equal to ten thousand. For C, rupees eight thousand. And this is the final answer.